Right, we're live. Link. <laughs> yeah, stay there. Just stay there. <gasps> Whoa, an ending. Are we live? I'm not even subscribed to Thermaltake, I can't believe it. Alright, we're live. Six watching now, okay. We're Link. live. I'm gonna send, uh, I'm gonna post the links on JP Modified. So, guys, hold on. Yeah, stay there. Just stay there. I'm going to. Whoa. <coughs> I'm start just posting the links. Are we live? We I'm not even subscribed to Thermaltake, you can't believe it. Alright, we're live. Six watching now, okay. We're live. I'm gonna send, uh, I'm gonna post the links on JP Modified. So, guys, hold on. Yeah, stay there. Just stay there. We're going to. Whoa. <coughs> Loading. Start. Hold on, Just guys. The links. So, we are live. I'm share. Gotta start the share we're first. Live. Before everything else, no. I'm not even subscribed to Turbo Tech, you can't believe it. Alright, we're live. Six watching now, okay. We're live. I'm gonna send, uh, I'm gonna post the links on JP Modified. So, guys, hold on. Yeah, stay there. Hey, sorry for the late start. I'm going to. Whoa. Guys. <coughs> now, start um, hold on, guys. The links. So, let me not live. try to not to pay sure. attention to the. Gotta start the share Why first wait. before I do the else. thing. I'm not even subscribed to Turbo. Uh, how am I gonna do this though? Alright, we're live. Six watching now, okay. We're live. How am I gonna do this? I'm gonna send uh, I'm gonna post the link. Never on tried Google anything like this. Guys, before. hold on. <laughs> so Hey! Sorry for the late start. I'm going to Guys. Whoa. Yeah, it's a delay because <laughs> now, start um, hold on, guys. Huh? Links. So let me are not live. try to not to pay attention oh, to the stream the, is the stream is like to share to first wait. before I do, do the else. thing no. I'm not even script to uh, how am I gonna do this though all right we're live six watching now okay we're live how am right. I gonna do this I'm gonna send uh, I'm gonna post the link. so we'll wait for a few more people like guys hold on I'm um, seeing only nine people so, watching hey that's not sorry for the late start <laughs> Guys, oh, yeah, yeah, it's a delay yeah. now um, hold on, on guys. Huh? So let me not live. try to not to pay share. attention. Oh, the stream <laughs> is the stream is like to uh, share uh, first. Right. So how you are you, thing, people not of the Philippines of the world? How am I gonna do this though? Um, I'm live. Six watching now. Okay. Yeah. So again, I right. uh, apologize I'm for send, such a delay in the stream. We were scheduled to go live at 2 p.m. today, but apparently. It's not Sorry for um, the late start. We experienced guys. heavy technical yeah. difficulties yeah. because yeah. of yeah. Uh, um, my yeah. my yeah. laptop. Yeah. Uh, hey Jesse, does yeah. multiple audio yeah. streams. Yeah. 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 So how are you, people um, of the Philippines? Of the world. How am I going to do this? Um, Six oh. watching now. Okay. Yeah. So there you go. again, I right. uh, apologize Audio, for such a delay uh, in the stream. We were scheduled to go live input, um, at 2, 2 p.m. today, but apparently, hey, I'm not sorry for the um, late start. We experienced okay. heavy yeah, technical yeah. difficulties oh. because of um, uh, this one. Um, my. How about that one? Is that okay now, Arky and Tim? Because, yeah, um, so, yeah, I, I turned off the, the mute, I muted my stream. How about now? Hmm? Huh? What? Now because I turned off my, yeah, okay, yeah, okay now. All right, sorry for that. Um, apparently, I am so noob when it comes to this software and technology and stuff like that. I only, I'm only a, a modder, a model. All right, so thank you guys for, share, uh, for joining the stream. 
Uh, we're gonna start in a bit. Uh, I don't want to start right now, like right away, because I want, uh, you know, I'm hoping to catch a little bit more people or get a little bit more people to join the stream. So, you know, you know how it is. Paul Lawrence. All right, Tim. Thank you. Yo, nagsimula na. Yeah, all good. So, again, this is Jesse of JP Modified. Um, I apologize for the delay in the scheduled stream. Now, we were um, <coughs> supposed to be scheduled to go live at 2 p.m. Now, apparently, we started setting up the whole thing. I, I set up the shop. Uh, I prepared all the materials. I was thinking about what I was going to say or talk to you guys about today. But um, when we were just about to get ready to get started, like in like 30 minutes from or an hour. Yeah, an hour before uh, we were supposed to go live or our scheduled time slot. Um, we figured out that it would work. First, we blamed the Internet outside for not being able to catch up to the. Uh, you know, to uh, to the signal that uh, to the signal that we needed for the live stream. Now we moved a table from the living room all over, uh, all the way over to a section of the house where we get better signal. We still couldn't get it to work, so we had a uh, good thing that we have a like a 75 mile long LAN cable that was able to reach from our router. Uh, all the way to straight to the laptop now we got that fixed we still it took us about another 30 minutes to find the freaking drivers for the for the LAN on the laptop we got that working and after that we realized that it was not the internet it was my laptop my laptop couldn't my laptop couldn't handle the you know the technology that OBS had to to dish out so uh, I'd like to say hi to all the people joining us right now. We got 18 people watching. Um, hi to archaeologist. I'll see you in a few minutes, bro. Hi to Tim, Paul, Kush, Ferdinand, Saison, Epic. What's up? Uh, one of my idols, GPA Works, and Tantric, the godfather of Filipino modding. So, anyways, uh, to get this thing started, um, we're I'm here to basically talk about uh, modding. Now, modding is so, let's say, it's 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 huge. Okay, um, it 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 deals with in general. It deals with modification. Okay, modification is the key word there. So, anything you do uh, to customize the case out of the box. I mean, you know, right. Uh, right after you take it out of the box is in a way to some certain extent or some degree you know uh, modding you could probably put in a sticker people would probably complain that it's not modding it's just putting stickers but again it didn't come like that out of the box so in a way to a certain degree it is still modding now a lot of us or a lot of computer enthusiasts uh, liked uh, customized computers and all that now um, <clears throat> Now the thing is, uh, a lot of people will think that uh, they can't do it because their tools are limited and stuff like that. Uh, trust me, I know how it is because that's how I started. Now there were so many things I wanted to do to my computer before, like a, like probably almost close to a decade ago, that I couldn't do because of lack of tools and resources. Now, um, since then, uh, the computer industry or the case manufacturing industry or whatnot has really, really evolved. Um, you know, cases are starting to, you know, uh, they're all getting better and better each release. Now, a lot of that has to do with modding because if it weren't for people who mod or if it weren't for people or for modders in general, cases would still look the same as it was before because... Um, people or the case manufacturers wouldn't um, <clears throat> wouldn't concentrate on improving anything because people would be content with what it's what's already there. So uh, you'd have limited fan slots 
Uh, you'd probably have closed cases. You'd probably have no windows and stuff like that. Now, a lot of that, or most of that, I, I'm confident enough to say, is because uh, it evolved because of modding. Now, uh, when water cooling was not uh, as you know available to everyone, uh, there were really people who were kamikazes in terms of water cooling in the early years. Um, they invented or they made water blocks and stuff like that. Um, right now, people can just go online and buy their own water cooling. Back then, people made their own water blocks, you know, systemized or, you know, integrated like uh, aquarium pumps for, for, you know, to get, you know, water flowing through the system. Um, again, that's all because people like to customize. Now, in order to catch up to, to the times, uh, computer case manufacturers were listening to the crowd. Um, they uh, basically, you know, went ahead and saw what the people wanted and then integrated it to cases. Now, the thing is, <laughs> when you talk about modding, people will always try to modify a case um, no matter h how good or how, how well built that case is. Let's say, for example, um, PSU covers. There you go. A PSU cover was not available in a lot of cases. Probably 99% of all the cases, probably, let's say, two, three years ago. Probably four years ago, even. Um, cases did not have, uh, you know, did not have PSU covers or bay covers or PSU compartments, right? <laughs> you know? And no, it's not my birthday. Thank you, Tantric, for starting that trend again. It's not my birthday. But yeah, back to what I was saying. PSU covers were not available in computers, no, in, in computer cases before. But since modders began to start making their own to cover the PSU, to hide the cables and such, now cases, or most of the cases I've seen now, have PSU covers. Um, they have different ways of executing how the PSU covers will look. But in general, they still serve the same purpose, right? Just to hide cables or hide all the clutter. Now, um, what we're going to do now, uh, a good example is uh, of a PSU cover modification right now is, um, is what I'm going to be showing you guys. It's going to be simple. You're not going to need like a whole lot of tools to do it. Okay. You'll probably need a lot of patience or, you know, some time, but you won't need any real tools that you need to buy or spend. You can probably just go to your um you know your kids if you have any uh, school bags and you could probably have it already all right so the case that we will be using and as, as an example is the new or one of new uh one of the new thermal take uh releases we saw this last computex and i have one here right now it's been sitting at the um warehouse or my warehouse for a good few months now probably three months because we are still trying to um you know catch up to all the backlogs and stuff like that and this is one of them and then just fresh out of the box you'll see the a700 tg case now the a700 tg case is a aluminum and steel frame uh and tempered glass mixed case now outside the case the the front panel is aluminum the top panel is aluminum full screen. huh full screen. what's full screen Oh, okay. I'm sorry. I didn't do full screen. How do I do full screen? Uh, hold on. Hold on. Another. Another. Um. How do I do full screen on this though? Oh, because it's it's showing my thing, right? It's showing my desktop. If I close it, it's not going to show anything anymore oh okay no 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 I think I know I think I know I will be showing a full screen of my face <laughs> there you go I hope that'll work for you guys there wait hold on it's not there you go. I'm sorry. 
I'm so sorry for that. <laughs> I was talking with a really small screen. Alright, now again, this is all new to me. So, I'm sorry. Hey, Mad Mods and, uh, oh, yeah. I mean, Rich. Hey, Rich, there you go. Bigger screen. I'm sorry, again. Uh, the person right next to me behind the screen is Kevin. Um, he's on standby just in case I need anything. But again, here we go. Again, let's go again. Um, yeah. So the case we'll be working on today is the uh, the thermal take is a thermal take uh, A seven hundred TG case. Now the A seven hundred TG case is a really, really, really solid case. Um, it's also heavy even without you know uh, without you know a full system inside. It, it's really heavy. So back to what I was saying. What we're gonna work on today is a a small modification now, there's a lot you can do to the case because um, me personally my favorite kind of cases are ones that are plain here because uh, the possibilities of what you want to do are endless because you can do so much to to the front it's like an empty piece of paper that you can do uh, so you know you can do whatever but what we're going to fo focus on right now is something inside the case. Now, let me remove the, the top. Hold on. There you go. So, <laughs> um, like I said earlier, case manufacturers integrated a PSU cover in most of the cases that you can find right there uh, that are available on the market right now. Now, Thermaltake is one of them who did it, who's, who's done it. <coughs> so, just FYI, I already un unlocked uh, or unscrewed some of the screws at the back of the case, so I can just remove this freely uh, without any problems. So, this is a sample of a PSU cover that comes in uh, or comes with the Thermaltake A700 TG right here okay it's a it has a ventilated top so you can you know flip your power supply up and down uh to whatever orientation you're used to so what we're going to take a look at is this window right here see this window there's a lot you can do to this window to make it a little bit more custom now a lot of you guys probably have like really cool power supplies that you want to show off um you know, ones with like, like for example, the new ARGB series um, thermal take uh, power supplies. Uh, they have this illuminated, um, you know, text at the side. So, um, some people might want to show that show that off, but some people don't want to show it off because their power supplies are probably uh, the older generation uh, that don't have any bells and whistles to it. It's just a really solid power supply. Um, but they still want to add a little bit more customization to the inside of the case. Now, we'll take a look at a, uh, an example. Uh, this one um, is something you can customize. This area here is something you can customize. Now, uh, I'm going to show you a really easy technique that a lot of modders are, are you know, do or have done or still doing um, uh, currently. Uh, it's called paint and tear. That's what I call it. So you paint over it and tear. Now I'll explain that later. Um, the advantage of this is it already comes transparent. So we'll take it off. Bin, Bin, can you give me um, pliers, long nose pliers? So yeah, uh, we're going to add a little bit more custom look to this area here. All right. So again, while we wait for the for the long nose pliers, uh, again, modding is all about how you express yourself. Now, now, uh, you know, you people really like to express themselves with the way they dress, the way they want to smell, the way they look, the way they cut their hair, uh, ladies, um, the way they put on their makeup, and stuff like that. So, it doesn't have to be limited to the way you look. It could be limit. It, you could take it all the way as far as you know to what you own so these aren't long nose pliers by the way Kevin these are pl 
wires. Uh, but these will, these this this will work, I think. So, um, hold on. Let me try to move the camera a little bit. Sorry, sorry for the shaky, shaky camera. I should have warned you guys earlier that uh, we're going. Uh, the camera is going to probably be moving so many times. Um, how do I put it? It should be like that. There you go. I hope that. I hope that's better. I hope that's better. So you guys don't have to look at my smug face. All right, so what uh, what we're going to do right now is we're going to remove this plastic area here. Now, all you need to do that is you need to bend these little uh, things, these little clips. You should know the difference because you're a man. So, yeah, so, um, yeah, so you bend these, these little tabs here at the back. Oh, there you go. Yeah, you can use, um, uh, you would, you should use pliers so you can reach the area. Let me take out this stuff. Oops, it's a little tricky to reach the uh, the back area. <laughs> Hold on. Hey, back to gaming. Shout outs to all the people uh, from. Back to gaming in Tondo, Manila. Sub Boss Mac. Thank you for joining the stream. Uh, <laughs> All right, so it's going to be a little bit tricky to remove this part here, but it it shouldn't be this hard. But right now, I'm trying to be careful because. I don't want to break this thing. I don't want to break this thing live in front of everyone. That'd be so not cool. So again, yeah, uh, I know there are probably a lot of professional modders looking at this stream right now now again this isn't for any professional modder they'd already know what to do um again like the title says it's uh if you guys are new to modding and um it, kev can you give me a knife please yeah so if you guys are new to modding this is something you probably don't know or haven't tried before so hi Hey Jello, what's up? Clark Jingbun, the Lichon boy. So, X Neil X mods. I think that's Ronio. Hey Ronio, what's up? Thank you for joining the stream, guys. I appreciate it very much. Again, we have moved inside the room because of computer capability problems so the tab here is pretty hard to reach the tab behind the the roof of the case is pretty hard to reach so that's why I'm having a 
pretty hard time. But, yeah. This stream is gonna last for about an hour, so I think that should be enough time. Now, once we paint this, it'll probably take another few minutes. So after that, uh, we're going to probably talk a little bit more about modding while we wait for the paint to dry or something like that. There you go, finally. So what we have here is a plain piece of acrylic that um, is a plain piece of acrylic. I don't really want to call this acrylic because this is actually not cast acrylic. Uh, it's made out of a different material. So, but yeah, it's still the technique that we're going to use right now is still would still apply nonetheless. All right. So since you already have this removed, you can customize this can put your name on it and stuff like that now that's what we're going to try to do today now in order for us to to do this again this is a really simple technique for those of you who want to get started now this isn't going to be the be all end all way that you should define pc modding okay this is just one of the easier ways for you to introduce yourself to the world of computer case customization now um again this piece is part of the Thermaltake A700 TG case that you can, you know, purchase and then, you know, uh, customize to however it is you like. Now, this is part of the PSU cover. And what we're going to do is we're going to take, get rid of this whole transparent section here. And then we're going to um, replace it with, with something a little bit more custom. Now, we have uh, probably two inch or two and a half inch piece of masking tape that we can use now this is the only thing I had av available because we really didn't have you know w well we had time to prepare for this stream but apparently um, I was blank I didn't know what to talk to you guys about but oh well uh, so I got some masking tape what I'm gonna do is I'm going to Mask the front area. Mask the front area close to the center. Just like that. Alright. And then probably mask a little bit more at the side. Now again, people, of those of you who already know how to mod, um, please don't expect to, to learn any uh, new tips and tricks on this stream. This is again for the audience that uh, that want that know nothing about modding, um, but would really like to get started. Now, all right, let me try to explain something. Now, the reason why I did not overlap, uh, I did not overlap uh, the masking tape is because we're going to be using a, an art knife to to score over it. So. Um, if you do double masking tape, you're gonna, you're gonna have, I mean, if your masking tape overlaps like this, you're gonna have a hard time trying to, to, you know, cut out the design that you want. Okay, so you already have that, like that right there, okay? Now, Bin, can you get me the cutting mat? Katong cutting mat ba sa? Katong green. Katong green ba? Yeah, so as I was saying, so you have it here right now. You masked over it. Like that. Again, this is plain masking tape. Now, you have, you will need an art knife. This one's relatively sharp, I hope. Um, I haven't used this much. I hope it's it'll still be sharp enough you'll need a pen I hope this one works does 
and you'll probably need a ruler for those more uh you know for those more uh, for those designs that that will require uh straight cuts and stuff like that so what can i log what what kind of logo would i like to put on this one again the, i know i've noticed that we have a few uh um already uh pro modders in the stream hello guys thank you for joining us thank you for the support uh this is for the noobs this is again for the no never mind house and the this is for the noobs for those of you oblivious to the world of modding okay so no hate low-key gunpla painting tips <laughs> yeah I did that yesterday Mac I did that yesterday low-key gunpla painting type so yeah. so here's a cutting mat so I don't ruin my beautiful thermal take level 20 extended mouse pad which will be prob which will probably be one of the giveaways that we're putting out, or that Thermal Take will be putting out for people who joining joining this stream. So hi guys, uh, for, again for those of you who um, uh, have joined us, uh, this is just a quick you know a quick video on how to you know put customization. All right, so I've managed to mask the the front area of the little window of the a700 tg now let's now try to let's now try to um think of a design what do you guys think would be a really good design <laughs> that was something that we could you know something that we could make less mistakes out of uh uh, yeah, we could do straight lines, but we'll, we'll probably do an illustration instead, yeah. like a drawing of a snake. <laughs> yeah, we'll, we'll we'll do a snake. <laughs> no curves. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, uh, we might not be able to pull it off, but yeah, we'll see. It'll get you a, a good idea. So, um, we'll try to do a little simple looking design. Now again, you can do this. You can put your name, you can put your, you know, your body parts. <laughs> you can draw body parts or, or your favorite logo or something like that. But right now, all I can think of is a snake, because, uh, yeah, because I think that's probably the easiest way to, to, uh, you know. To illustrate what I'm trying to double star no that's Dibil Dibil that's Dibil Dibil Dark JR we'd like to welcome the presence of Dark JR one of Thermal Takes uh, sponsored streamers one of the very first sponsored streamers so <laughs> how do I make this not look into <laughs> not look like a uh, this is not a sperm cell this is a snake okay people get with the picture this is a snake all right it's not one of those it's not one of those floaters that come out of your that come out of your body parts but yeah this is a snake okay try to put this in your head visualize this as a snake people this is not thing this is not uh <laughs> A cell that you are guys are all accustomed to. This is a snake. Okay. This is a snake. Oh, wait. Hold on. F just for those people who have dirty minds. Well, I'm going to turn this into a lizard. Okay. Let's make this into a lizard. 
a really skinny lizard. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Again, this is a, no, no. I'm not a. I'm not a, a, an illustrative type of person. I'm just a. You know. Yeah. So we're gonna put some feet. Just so people don't get the wrong message. I'm gonna put some little feet on it. So it's no longer. <laughs> okay, GPA works. Try to make it more difficult for me. Alright, so. Um. <laughs> yeah, so. Wait, hold on. No. We're not. We're gonna try not to get away past this. So it's gonna probably be. A snake like that wait hold on I think I did this wrong yeah yeah so yeah kind of looks like a snake right it kind of looks like a lizard <laughs> a lizard that just had a stroke <laughs> because he lost all his power on his left arm so yeah Put ice. hi GB ice. Yeah, I'm gonna put. I, I, yeah, it's gonna be hard to peel off the eyes, though. Oh, yeah, no, it isn't. Okay, I'm gonna put eyes. See, it has eyes now, and we're gonna. Okay, so it has a tongue. See, so cool. Look at my snake, people. Look at my snake. It's so nice. So again, this is not to illustrate my 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 drawing skills or anything like that this is just to show you guys a general picture of what i mean <laughs> so yeah screw someone screenshot this <laughs> just the teaching <laughs> teaching people how to draw i should have brought my son i should have brought my son here i'm pretty sure he can you know he'll do a better job <laughs> but again get with the program snake with <laughs> snake with snake yeah this is, yeah paul this is the snake all right this is a snake do not argue with me or else i will ban you no i'm just kidding all right so so you do you drew your illustration you drew your whatever you know you, you don't have to do a snake like i'm doing but you know this is just uh, for the heck of it now you get your scoring knife all you do is trace over what you just drew. Now you have to do this really slowly, okay? But you gotta make sure that you're cutting close enough to not leave, uh, you know, when you tear off the, the thing. Oh shoot. I, I could just cut off his foot. <laughs> I just cut off the snake's foot. Crap. All right. Mm. Sorry. I cut off the lizard's foot. Sorry for that. Yeah. So. I need you to just trace over as as accurately as you can. Now, for those of you who have uh, a sticker cutter, a silhouette cameo, this would not be a, much of a problem at all. So, thank you, JB, for holding the camera for me. You're going to have to stay there for another two hours, though, because I'm going to take my time cutting the fat fingers off my, my lizard snake. But, yeah, again, people, this is a snake, okay? Get with the program. <laughs> yeah, you can use your name. You can cut out your name. You can cut out your, you know, whatever design that you like. If you're an artist and have a natural lack, uh, natural, natural skill uh, for for drawing, then you will have one of the most basic skills in modding okay. yeah this is a snake for those of you who joined us I'm cutting out 
a snake with feet 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 snakes okay this is a, f a feeted snake <laughs> I don't hate my drawing people don't hate the player hate the game now you gotta be you gotta pay close attention though to where you're cutting since you don't wanna leave oops I made a mistake there. You don't want to leave anything uncut. This is a snake. Poisonous Antomoy. My pagbaboy ako ng drawing. I should have drew a, a lechon. Clark. Clark lechon. <laughs> it's. What's up, Corey? No hating, please, on my snake. <laughs> my footed snake. I'd like to acknowledge the presence of designs by IFR, Corey and Amelia. What's up, guys? Thank you for joining this stream. Those two folks, I've spent probably two or three Computexes with. They're really cool. Uh, one of the people I highly respect in the industry. Designs by IFR. Very nice people. So, there you go. The snake has been traced. I'm so sorry that Jeb has to hold on to the okay. to the to the camera. But yeah, my lovely assistant. Now what you want to do is carefully peel off the rest of the masking tape. Now again, you could use better avenues. Vinyl works better, like probably a million times better than masking tape, but we don't have that. Uh, we don't have white vinyl, by the way, so you can't draw over white vinyl. I mean, um, anything other than than white. So I don't even know why I I masked that area. Sorry, you don't have to mask that whole area. All right, so slowly. Because masking tape will not work very well. With vinyl, this is not a problem. With masking tape, it's a little bit more of a chore, but you can still probably you can pull it off with a little bit of patience and uh, and love for what you do. Again, make sure all the edges are cut. Yes, that snake. <laughs> <laughs> Cartoon snake. Oh my God, people! Can't you see? This is not a. This is a lizard. Lizard snake. Now I got to be careful on this because I accidentally cut off uh, one of its feet. <laughs> Got to be really patient. This is not going to be perfect, you guys. And no, this is not how I normally do my my mods. But this is just, uh, you know, a way. For you guys to get your feet wet, you know, jump in the water and get yourself start customizing your own, you know, your own PC and stuff like that. Now, a lot of us modders, especially in the Philippines, especially the ones I know personally, started off 
their modding careers with this simple technique. I, for one, did. I remember a few years ago when I figured I didn't even copy this. Um, it's it's a technique that's been used over and over again before, but to tell you guys the truth, to be honest, I didn't copy anything. I just figured it out, and I just didn't I didn't know that this is basically the general way of doing it. So too bad, but okay, at least I figured that part on my own. So yeah. Again, this is modding. This is modding. This is not like it's not extreme modding like uh, a lot of other people do, but it's something you know, you guys got to start somewhere, you know, you don't, you don't be turn into a professional athlete overnight. You don't turn into like, you know, a world champion boxer or, or mixed martial artist overnight. You have to start somewhere. Every boxer starts out by punching, punching bags, right? Every runner uh, starts out by running away from the law. <laughs> But yeah, so this is where a good a, a good place for you to start. I for one again, uh, this is where I started, and a lot of other modders I know. This is where they started. Now, the reason why this is so good, this is so nice, is because it introduces you to a certain aspect that you probably don't know you had. You know, like your your creative side. You know, people don't know. So a lot, I know a lot of people who don't know they were creative until their their late, you know, age, uh, late stages in life. Um, I had a friend who said he didn't know how to draw. It was a friend of mine in a call center before. Um, shout out to you, Steve. He didn't realize he knew how to draw until we asked him to do a banner for for our Christmas party. And he swore he never drew a thing in his life. And then he realized that uh, he actually <laughs> knew how to draw and draw very well. So, here you guys. Here it is. Oh, sorry. Where was the camera? There you go. Ay. Sorry, excuse me. Okay, I'm going to work. I'm going to Burger King. Alright, thank you. Yay. Sorry for that life. Alright, so. This is my snake. With the feet. Alright. This is my snake with feet. <laughs> Alright, so we're gonna... I'm gonna have my lovely assistant rest her... Sexy arms. No. Are you good, Ben? So this is the illustration that we came up with. All right, a snake that just had a heart attack. <laughs> so <laughs> snake that just had a heart attack. No, not a snake. Thermal take, not a snake. Thermal take. So this is my rendition of a quick, you know, like you know, few second drawing. All right. Now after you've cut out your illustration, after you cut out this uh, illustration, you make sure that you press on the edges and make sure that it's completely flat, because you don't want any paint seeping in uh, to, you know, to the design. Now again, this is really. Uh, this you need to press it most especially with masking tape because naturally the texture of masking tape has these little waves in it all right so um, <laughs> so what we're gonna do is what's uh what's the color of a, a lizard with or a snake with legs nowadays green green do we have green do you have green yeah so uh, we're gonna so what we're gonna do <laughs> yeah, Shenron. 
this is what we're gonna do what we're gonna do is we're gonna paint the front area with the color that you want the uh, the the base to be so if you want the base to be black you color it black all right now you paint the back portion okay the back portion with the color you want your object to be like you see let's say if you put in a name you put yeah you know, like uh, let's say Darth JR you put in Darth JR cut out the the name and you want the the word Darth JR to be black or red so you color the na uh, the the color you paint the back I'm sorry you paint the back of the uh, of the piece with the color you want your object to be okay again for those of you who don't know and who are new to this the base of the color I mean the base of the piece that you're trying to do or work on is what you paint the front now the back is what you paint the color of what you want the object to be did I just fumble that but yeah so if you want a red snake or a red lizard snake or whatever this is you paint the back red right if you want a green lizard snake you paint the back green okay and then again the color of the whole piece itself you color at the front now I'm gonna take this thing over to my painters Jebby is going to do us the honor of painting um, that's gonna be for another stream or for another modder uh, tips and tricks on how to paint um, what we're gonna do right now is just we're gonna have this quickly painted so uh, I think we're gonna we're gonna do a green snake if we can find green or whatever color and then just black all right so it's probably gonna take a good uh, a good um, 30 minutes for that thing to dry but that's just basically it so what we're gonna do right now is we're gonna I am going to talk to you I'm gonna now talk to you guys about I'm gonna I'm now here to answer questions or talk about or interact with you guys so apparently all the people joining us are people who know me I see 20 uh, 27 people online but I don't see any unfamiliar faces or unfamiliar names so most of you already know so um <laughs> all right so we're gonna do a giveaway thanks to thermaltake we're gonna do a quick giveaway on um <laughs> all right Corey. what it was a, a four-legged snake Corey. <laughs> all right thermaltake so again as of you uh for those people joining us right now on the stream um we are doing a giveaway or thermaltake is doing a giveaway uh for the people who joined this stream Okay, so um, if you are, um, you know, part of this stream, showing your support to Thermal Take and to this stream, uh, Thermal Take is giving away some really cool prizes. Um, I don't know ex exactly what uh, the mechanics are, but I know for one that your name has to be on these uh, this list of viewers. So um, I'm seeing. Only a few people I know. Tantric, Eldan. I hope you're doing well, bro. Uh, I know Roniel. I know Archaeologist Gaming. He's supposed to be on his way here right now. Uh, back to gaming. Boss Mac, GPA. So, Rich, Ferdinand, uh, Clark, uh, Jingbon. Um, designs by IFR. Let's disqualify Designs by IFR already. Because he probably has everything. Uh, that you will give away. <laughs> but yeah, uh, Curdy. We have, you know, just a <laughs> razor. Yeah, that was a razor. Razor lizard. Yeah, um, I would have made my my logo, but see, the problem is my, my logo is too symmetrical. Now, it'll need specific measurements and stuff like that. Uh, so I will need probably a ruler and a little bit more time to to execute that now my logo looks really simple 
but when you really take a look at it, if you want a really good job doing it, um, you will take your time trying to cut that part out. So, you know, um, I kind of just opted out of doing my logo. So I just did a snake because a snake is really, really, really easy to draw. So, <laughs> thank you, chicken feet. So I'm just back reading. All right, I'm just back reading on all the comments. Again, thank you guys for all your support. Um, uh, you, you know, um, this is the first time uh, that Thermal Takes have, has done this, um, and uh, I thank Thermal Takes, especially Kenny, Andy, John, uh, Johnny, and Tony, everyone else uh, responsible for, um, you know, uh, giving me the honor of being the first one to, to. Uh, to do this live stream there this is pro hopefully this is going to be probably a series of um of uh, other streams that's going to be held by thermal take uh probably gaming um next on the list uh we're going to try to get um gamers to actually you know to show their uh this their skills or whatever game they play using thermal take level 20 gear and stuff like that but you know those are all in the works uh depending on how this stream goes all right so yeah so this is it now again um th uh thank you very much everyone netim uh you always you know you're always there to support me thank you very much bro uh i totally appreciate it um i don't really you know respond to some comments on my facebook page or my personal page because um I have this habit of after I post something, I turn off not notifications. So, and then they slip my mind. And then, you know, I, I sometimes I reply probably like weeks later after an old, really, really old comment. So, you know. So, Ferdinand Saison, is Thermal Take going to do a giveaway of the PC you modded? Actually, no. I'm hoping they won't because the drawing I just did as an example is horrible. You wouldn't want that on your rig, bro. Uh, but they will have something else um, planned for this giveaway. Uh, just stay tuned for any announcements they have on their uh, Thermal Take page. Uh, if you guys haven't followed, just go ahead and follow the the, uh, the Thermal Take um, land, uh, Facebook page. And uh, be sure to... Oh, the prize is a TT Rio uh, Trio 3-pack. No, those fans are really nice. Uh, they they look... Um, they're the brightest, actually. Uh, we're going to have... We have a few projects in line that that use the TT Trio. We also had, uh, I think, more than one project which uses a full TT Trio setup. But uh, it's, uh, it's, in an, it's in my YouTube channel somewhere. But yeah, so there it is. There's a big announcement. Um, the Ring Trio. <laughs> no, the drawing. No. So this is the giveaway. Okay, the Thermal Take. The giveaway from Thermal Take is going to be the TT Ring Trio, a uh, trio fan, a uh, triple, uh, triple fan pack, and the drawing I just did today live. So this is a part of history. Now, if you take a look. If you if you if you uh, if you think about it if you think about it, um, this is probably the first stream, uh, not actually the first live stream. TT does that all the time, but this is probably one of the more let's say uh, un unpublished. No, I don't know what you call it. Personal stream because it's me here. Uh, you know, I'm not. In a, in a special, you know, special event or something. But, you know, um, uh, 20 years down the line, this is probably going to be a part of Thermal Takes history. So <laughs> that drawing I just did will probably be worth so much. <laughs> oh, okay. yeah, Corey, I will. <laughs> you can't be the first. <laughs> you can't. You're not. No, no. I automatically... Uh, disqualify you to be part of any giveaway <laughs> except for the drawing i will give you ten dollars okay bidding starts at ten dollars i see i see rich uh, or scoob from thailand um bid ten dollars for that four-legged snake i just drew 
All right. So bidding ten dollars, going once, going twice. Okay, I have another bid from Back to Gaming. It's twelve dollars plus Eternal Friendship <laughs> for the snake. Cool. So I got twelve dollars. The current bid right now is twelve dollars plus the Eternal Friendship or an e <laughs> Eternal Friendship for the snake. So that's it. So I'm probably gonna going once, going to us. Okay, designs by our IFR is gonna buy for fourteen dollars. Let's keep it going, guys. Let's keep it going, guys. That's uh, um, remember thirty years from now that drawing is gonna be part of Thermal Takes history. So when Thermal Takes celebrates their um fiftieth year in business, this is gonna be part of it. So that thing is or that that thing that I just drew. <laughs> It's going to be part of his history. $11, no. There's a bid for 14 We can't go back. All right. Rich is now <laughs> bidding $15 in my heart. All right. Archaeologist plus free food. Yeah. I'll take the pre uh, I'll take the free food part from you, dude. Um, since uh, you, you're coming over anyway, so just bring free food as a tip. Chinese new <laughs> young plus one litro coke. Yeah, that has to be enough to feed 14 people. Because I am probably worth five people in the house. And then, you know, seven other people live here. So. <laughs> push it. Personally, push you in the wheelchair at Computex. That is a good. That's a good bid. I think we got a winner here by Corey. Because I want my girlfriend to, to not go through that hassle anymore. So I think we have a winner. No one can beat that. That's the best offer that you get. That's the best offer offered now. <laughs> okay, so we have a winner, Corey. I will bring that. I'll put it in a in a in a frame. I'll put it in a frame, and I'll you know, I'll put it in a glass frame or a glass box for you. So we have a winner, Corey, or Amelia, whoever is talking right now. Um, designs by IFR is twenty dollars plus. Uh, Push me on the wheelchair <laughs> at CAD Computex. That'll be so fun. So as long as you, you, you know, don't break any speed limits. So yeah. So how, um, uh, how else? <laughs> so what else are we going to talk about? Hey, you guys any have any questions apart from those who already know how to mod? Um, any questions, any, 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 uh, any, any words of wisdom? Okay. Uh, I don't think that I'm going to be getting any questions from this crowd. So I'm going to be talking about um, something general that you might want to ponder on. Uh, ponder on if you, you know, moving towards uh, your career. Now, hopefully. Now, again, what I show you, uh, I'm going to look at the camera because I'm going to I want this to be a little bit more personal. Now, uh, again, what I showed you is nothing extraordinary nothing that hasn't been done before uh it's nothing like it's it's a drawing drawing of a four-legged snake but please do keep in mind that the thought that um i'm trying to push to you guys is the thought that uh obstacles are only obstacles if you allow them to be obstacles now um if you keep telling yourself that you can't do it then i'm sorry to tell you you aren't gonna do it um and nothing's gonna happen if you want, but if you keep pushing yourself, if you have the right mindset to keep, you know, to put in your head, uh, you can do it. You will figure out a way to do it. If there's a will, there's a way. So, um, uh, you know, in, in terms of modding, um, what I just showed you is something a little bit more basic. Now, you just, we just, all we did, all we used is um, masking tape, um, an art knife, and... Uh, smiles basically and some paint and then it is a good first step in terms of um, your modding career or whatever it is that you want to do you don't have to make modding as your career you could do it as a hobby I started or most of us started uh, modding as a hobby um, until it turned into something that we do professionally now um, keep in mind that uh, you never you never put yourself down on any result that you that you produce now a lot of people you will never please anyone uh, everyone I'm sorry um, but you never allow that to put yourself down the now the reason for that is as human beings as human beings, I keep saying this all the time you naturally get better at things that you love to do now 
if you let's say if you love to go to work but um uh let's say for example the first day of work uh it takes you if you walk to work okay it's, it's it, let's say you, you you live probably like five minutes or ten minutes away from your job um the first day you're gonna probably walk it's gonna probably be you're gonna get tired because of that walk of that 10 minute walk but then as the time as time progresses you will enjoy your work and then you do it every single day and because you love your work you will not feel tired anymore going to work so naturally you got better at doing what you did um uh let's say for example um drawing now i don't draw i don't draw uh i do draw i can copy drawings but if something from that i can't properly illustrate anything that comes out of my head i have really nice uh creativity that floats in my head but they're just all ideas but when i try to put them in on, on a piece of paper it just doesn't come out the way i'm planning or the way i planned it to so but however if i did if i loved drawing if i wanted to keep doing that if i did it every single day and i just love doing it i will naturally get better okay it's practice it doesn't have to be talent it doesn't have to be skill because skill you develop okay um it, it you develop skill with practice now a lot of us are not talented or not a lot of us uh, with drawing um a lot of us aren't born with the skill to to illustrate or something like that but then with constant practice you get better because again we are human beings we naturally get better at things we love to do so um don't any don't let any criticism or don't let any any negativity uh get in the way of your progress now just do your work do what you love do it with passion and then you know and then you'll get better so back to the topic um the the thing we did the thing we did was not good now i know i do modding as a professional hobby but i'm not an illustrator now um what we did is a good first step now get go grab some masking tape put it on a piece of clear acrylic that you can put on your computer because again it's just starting you know getting started is the toughest part in life there are uh there are difficult things one is to get started and one is to keep going so that's basically it so leading back to the project artist to be honest netim to be the hardest thing is the creative part yeah you do need to have create uh, the, the creative creativity um but see there's a, there's a thing um if you're curious enough you will develop creativity you know because you're not brain dead you're not brain dead um you know your 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 mind will naturally think of things um the biggest reason why we say we're not creative is because of the lack of the ability to output um what it is we have on our heads so we automatically say to ourselves that we're not creative but which is not the case really um we're all creative we're all creative uh you know we can be creative by the way we sit down you know we, anything we do we can be creative with um it's just our ability to output that into a piece of paper that automatically defaults our brain to tell us that we're not creative but you know we're all creative just need to be curious enough and all that so that's basically basically it motivation speech <laughs> yeah um you know since we do have a lot of downtime uh, since we're waiting for that piece of um the thing or that thing we painted <laughs> the four-legged snake we painted so why not we use this time to talk about certain things to motivate you to get started but again fortunately enough what we use is um the, the yeah Uh, what we use here at the shop is mostly RJ London paints. Oh no, Sherlock's and RJ London. Now RJ London is an is an enamel based paint, and it dries a little bit faster than acrylic or lacquer. So this is the result. So Jebby has already managed to paint 
this section see so cool right now what we're gonna do i mean as you notice also behind it's painted green see so the base is black and the lizard will be green now what i'm gonna do is i'm going to move the camera again sorry close your eyes if you guys get dizzy very easily i'm going to, oops I'm going to move it. Can you again? Maybe. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Close your eyes, guys. I'm going to tell you. I'm going to get back to you when you. Yeah. Sorry, sorry for for that. Can you turn on the light? There you go. See, there you go. Here it is. Our painted piece. Now, what you do is you get your scoring knife, and use the very the sharpest tip, to carefully peel out again we're dealing with masking tape we're not dealing with with vinyl vinyl is a lot easier to to deal with you peel it off see and you peel it off slowly now the reason why you peel it off slowly is because it's the best way to to remove or to eliminate the adhesive uh, left over adhesive you'll you will you will have left over um, we'll use a puller this time or yeah tweezers here in the Philippines we call it puller because it pulls things uh, armpit hair removers <laughs> so again you do it slowly now you can do it faster than I do but the way I do it the reason why I do it I want to do it slowly is because I don't want adhesive I tried to get rid of as much as adhesive as I can on out of the the thing we just drew. So, so again, if you guys have a, a a silhouette cameo or sticker cutter, this would be a piece of cake. But again, not a lot of us have twenty thousand pesos to buy that kind of stuff especially if you just want to do it as a hobby so this is like caveman style modding if uh, for lack of a better term this is caveman style modding so this is probably how modding would be back in back in the day of Cro-Magnon Cro-Magnon This is really easy now. Easy mounting. Again, I don't know if anyone here is an actual noob at modding. I know JR is, but I don't know if the rest who's watching this stream uh, have no, you know, have modding experience. So. All right, so here we go. Here is our lizard. Snake, abstract lizard something. As we did, see see that little shadow at the bottom makes it look like it's been cut out. See, this is how, this is why I like it, you know, like, like this technique so much. Now, another thing is, if you, hold on a second. Um, sorry, we can just, uh, if we use if you put it behind, can't see. Huh? What do you mean? You can't see the screen if it's showing. Oh, I can't. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> My bad. All right, above here. See, if you put it behind the light, it'll light up. See, if you put it behind the light, it'll light up. So all you need to do is put in, you know, some LEDs at the back. And then, 
or here. See? Just put the uh, behind the screen and you'll have light. See, you'll have a lit mod. So that's basically it. Sorry for all the shaking. Just close your eyes if you get dizzy. So again, this is it. All right. Now all you need to do is put it back. So we're going to try to put it back. Oops. Put it back and not drop it. Rebend the tabs. Tabs are pretty hard. This take this case is built like a tank, bros. So tabs are not gonna be easy to. So here it is. So here it is, right there. Now we're gonna put this back in the case. I'm gonna put the camera. I'm gonna hold the camera. I'm gonna put it back. Sorry for all the movements, guys. Thank you, Jeb. So here it is, the snake of all creations. The snake of all creations. The snake of all creations. All you need to do is put it back in the case. like so and there you have it there you have it guys um your own your very own right. we're gonna use our phone to illuminate your very own modded power bay cover really looks really nice and then if you put in a, a light It'll glow. Woohoo! Woohoo! See? So, really easy. Easy, 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 easy. Um, easy way to mod. It's an easy way to mod. Now, again, uh, we used only uh, an art knife, masking tape, and a pen. Now, these aren't special tools. You can find this. Can you turn off the light, baby? Yeah, these aren't special tools at all. Uh, you can find this anywhere. You know, you can find probably there. You probably got a lot of these. Now, again, this is not the be-all, end-all technique in modding. Okay, there's so much more when it does, when it comes to modding. But this is a good start. Uh, like I mentioned earlier, a lot of us professional modders, or modders at least who do it, as a, uh, a profession um, started this way we all uh, most of us most of the people I know at least started off with this simple technique now with this simple technique we advanced into um, you know we advanced into different techniques now we have been doing this for years until I rewarded myself with a laser cutter uh, and a friend of mine also Eric B mods uh, from Canada uh, gifted me a a uh, silhouette sticker cutter so a lot of us a lot of us um, a lot of us a block by overlay I'm sorry sorry am I blocked by overlay That's fine. okay my eyes are blocked by overlay oh it doesn't matter all right, so anyways, yeah, so a lot of us, back to what I was saying, a lot of us started off with this simple technique. So, um, yeah, uh, yeah, um, yeah, a lot of us, uh, yes, I'm sorry, I got sidetracked, I'm sorry. Yeah, so a lot of us got started, or a lot of us modders got started by this simple technique. Now, we don't we hardly use it anymore but it was um the way we we well, most of us started now i know a lot of us 
a lot of people I know started off with the same technique. Uh, a lot of modders even now actually still use it and make money off of it and stuff like that. Now, that's a really simple technique. Now, again, of course, since you're going to be dealing with clients, you're going to have to be, you know, you're, you're going to have to come up with something more than a four-legged snake like I did now. <laughs> Uh, what I did right now is just an example of how how you guys you know could get your could get your you know could get the ball rolling um, to get yourself started in modding. Uh, there's a lot of other there are a lot of um, videos out on YouTube, my channels um, most especially, and a lot of other channels online. Um, Corey's uh, Devi the designs by IFR shows certain techniques. Uh, Die Tech. Um, a lot of other uh, people have been, you know, are, are trying to promote modding as uh, something a lot of, you know, or most of us or most of you guys can do. So, again, um, the core here is to, the, the, the core understanding here is to not yourself, not limit yourself to, to negativity, okay? Um, just always focus on how you can execute something rather than what's keeping you from doing it okay so it's 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 how you find a way you know you are defined by how you figure out ways to do things you want to do so if if you're always bound by by the excuse of not being able to do something because of this and because of that then that means you're never going to be um nothing's going to happen nothing's going to happen uh you 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 won't meet your dreams you won't you know, uh, not a lot is going to happen in your life if you keep that mindset nah, that, you know, if you always think of reasons why you can't do things. Now, a um, prime example, again, is what we showed you here today. Uh, basicest of all basic uh, knowledge in terms of modding. Uh, paint the front and paint the back, tear out the sticker, put some LEDs in it, and then there you go. So don't limit yourself to that, though. And keep in mind, don't limit yourself to that. Um, stretch it out or as much as you can, that technique, as much as you can. You don't have to limit it to drawings. You can limit it through through other things, like, you know, um, uh, basic lighting inside your PC and stuff like that. Um, but, you know, again, uh, the, the core here is to start because the two most difficult things in life is starting and keeping on going so um if you manage to start so that means you only have one problem left to live with is to keep going i myself am keeping on going so that's basically it so i'm taking a look at uh uh comments here uh, we're going to talk to Ferdinand. Uh, more tutorials, please. Especially with soldering wire with LEDs. Now, um, that's a little bit more complicated uh, to teach. Um, uh, there are a lot of other, um, let's say, sources you can get, uh, materials, uh, source materials you can for basic soldering. Um, I can't solder, uh, to be honest. I, I can solder, but... It takes me like twice the amount of time to solder some something that could be done, you know, in lesser time. So, so that's basically it. Now, all right. In terms of uh, back to what a lot of people are saying here for is the giveaway. Now, I'm gonna take a look at a PM from Andy, and then we'll see. Uh, hold on. Oh, no. Apparently, he didn't PM me. Uh, he PM Jeb. Let me see. So. So, Thermaltake Global will be choosing a lucky winner. All right. Or I will be choosing a lucky winner. That's going to be so hard to do. Um, I don't want to do this. I don't want to choose a lucky winner because... Uh, a lot of the uh, people joining the stream are people I know personally. So, uh, Andy boy, <laughs> that's your chore, bro. You you pick the lucky winner. You pick the lucky winner. And uh, you pick the lucky winner. And um, 
yeah, you pick the lucky winner, and then uh, people who win will have to message you on Facebook or something. I don't know how this giveaway thing works, to be honest, dude. So, uh, <laughs> yeah, I don't know how this giveaway thing will work. But, yeah, so that's that's the rule. Um, people who have commented on this chat stream and uh, or Andy is going to probably, uh, or Thermal Take is going to probably put in a, a list and randomly do a little, uh, a little like, shuffle or something. R raffle. GPA works. Pick me a doll. Just your number one fan here. Hey, dude, I wish I could. Man, if if, if, that, if that was the case, I would give everyone a prize. Um, again, acknowledging. Is it me or this guy looks like Tom Hardy? I don't even know who Tom Hardy is. Who is Tom Hardy? Is that that guy from Venom? No. I don't. <laughs> All right. Yeah, Corey. Corey has an interesting. Here you go. Corey has an interesting, uh, an interesting um, mechanic. Thank you, Corey. All right. So since this is a live stream, you guys can't click back. Um, I want to pay. I want to see uh, who was actually listening and was just here. You know, I want to separate the people who are actually listening and. Um, Separate them from the people here who was just trolling. So, um, what's a good question? All right, here you go. Give me a quote that I let let go just now on this stream. Anyone can repeat to me a quote that I just a life quote <laughs> that I just uh, you know said on this stream will be illegible. Or we'll have a times two chance of winning. We'll put your name in twice on the list. All right. We'll put your name twice on the list. So anyone here on this stream who can repeat or not exactly repeat, but just get a general gist or general idea of what I just, uh, one of the quotes, quotes that I put in um, early here today, will have times two chance of winning. Practice makes perfect, actually. Yeah, I'll, I'll accept that, but that's that's not how I mentioned it. That's kind of too generic. Practice makes perfect. I'm not, you know. <laughs> there you go. You can't impress everyone. Practice makes perfect. You can't impress. Yeah, that's JR. So we got JR here. That's a good one. You can't impress everyone with your work. Okay, there you go. Archaeologist came up with something better. If you think you can do it, you'll never do it. Perfect. Uh, Ferdinand here. Okay, continue doing what you have. Skill can be developed. Yes, continue doing what you have. As humans, we naturally get better. Good. If you think you can't do it, then you can't do it. There you go. Another one from Paul. The strong shall live and the weak shall die. <laughs> the strong the strong shall live and the weak shall die and the strong shall weak and the weak shall strong okay <laughs> all right yeah so we got a few honesty is the best policy yeah okay <laughs> all right there you go rich rich that's that's a good thing at least you were actually listening to the actual tutorial cut slowly to ensure it looks clean something like that yeah something like that Okay, so Rich has a double entry. Hope ha Andy, I hope I hope you're tuning in, man. There's a lot of people on this list that you gotta <laughs> that you gotta put in twice for the raffle, dude. Well, you said a lot of good things. To be fair, you told me that we can't put out your captivity on paper. That will hold us down. Okay, that was that's that's something I said. All right, madam, that that that'll work. Yeah, that's actually it. That's one of the things I said. Never you limit yourself to negativity. GPA works has the snake is going to be expensive. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't know if that'll count, but I'll take that. No ID, no entry. Oh, no ID, no entry. Or no apple, no lechon. No apple, no lechon by Clark. If there's a will, there's a way. Yeah, I said that. Yeah, pretty much. This is a snake. <laughs> what doesn't kill you is not. Yeah, that's my Facebook thing. All right, Andy. Hi. So, dude, I'm talking to Thermal Take here, um, Andy. Who is behind the lines? Hey, everyone, say hi to Andy. 
Okay, so here are the mechanics of this giveaway uh, of TT Rio 3-pack fan. Now, the mechanics of this giveaway is you got to comment on this chat. Second, uh, yeah, just that's basically the main, that's the main, um, that's the main mechanic is to comment on this chat. Now, to double your chances of winning, you need to repeat something I said on the stream. Okay, something I said on the stream, be it, uh, you know, anything I said on the stream <laughs> will take anything. Uh, you know, a phrase, any phrase I repeat uh, that, that I said on the stream. And third is to say hi to Andy. If no one here says hi, Andy, or thank you. No, no. Thank you, Thermal Take. Yeah. Okay. So these again, the main mechanic to get your name on the list of the raffle draw uh, for a TT Rio, Tring, uh, Rio Trio Ring Pack is to get, um, uh, is to comment. All right. To double your chances of winning, you got to do two things. So uh, double your chances of winning uh, means that we'll put your name in the raffle or in the draw twice. So uh, one way to double your chance of winning is to... Oh, no, not one way. The, the two other ways to double your chances of winning are... Uh, is or are, whatever, uh, is to repeat a quote that I said or a phrase that I said on the stream. And second is to say thank you, term thermal tank. That's basically it. So that's basically it. So thank you, thank you, TT. Hi, Andy. There you go. Thank you, TT. Hi, Andy. Thank you, thermal tank. Give me that level twenty table. Yeah, <laughs> the level twenty table is something. Really, it's really cool. Thank you, thermal tank. Thank you, Rahul. So, anyways. Uh, We've been on the stream for 91 minutes. How how long is two hours? 120 minutes. Huh? Yeah, I know. How long is two hours? So 100, 120 minutes. So, you reckon we guys keep going for about until until we reach like about two hours? Because I'm being billed. I'm billing them for the hour here. <laughs> Good luck, daddy. Who's your daddy? Andy. So yeah, so we'll probably stay on for a little bit uh, for a few more minutes because I'm billing for the hour by the hour. What is this? Connections LEDs. Oh, this is hours. Mm. Oh, okay. Oh yeah, this is something you can use, by the way, to connect yourself to the LED strips. Yeah, this is something that's really you don't really need to solder LED strips. Oh yeah, this question is for Ferdinand. If you want to solder, this eliminates soldering LEDs, bro. You can buy those. You can buy these by the pack at Lazada. These are LED connectors or LED strip connectors. The uh, twelve volts only, please. Uh, or apparently, yeah. Okay. Nah, uh, let's try to not him have them come. He doesn't even know how to solder. You know? So, yeah. So, um, yeah. Start off with 12 volts. This is 5 volts ready also. But apparently that it requires a little bit more technique. But, you know, because you got to cut off a certain wire. But, yeah, this one is, yeah. You can buy these as a, a in Lazada for uh, by the pack. And you can also um, buy a roll of LEDs. Now... The thing here is you don't have to solder anymore because you can just clip them. You can just clip the lead strip here. I don't know how this works though. But yeah, oh no. How do you open this? But yeah, this is this is anti-soldering. Check it up on YouTube. I haven't used this before. But Kevin, my assistant, has used these. Uh, these eliminate the need for um, for soldering. Uh, LED strips. All you need to do is just connect it. All right. So, Ferdinand, this one's for you, bro. You can use this for lighting. You can buy this at Lazada. Lead strip connector. I don't know what kind of word that you, you can input, but yeah, you can use these. Um, if your motherboard is, uh, you know, so that'll work. Make it five hours. Damn, yeah, dude. I wish I could. If I, I wish I had the air power to make this five hours. So, <laughs> yeah. 
Yeah, right. So, so comments on the live stream that that will you know is going to be, um, it's going to be by the time. Congratulations, GPA works. Woo there you go. Congratulations, GPA works. Thermaltake has officially announced the winner of the of the giveaway on the stream. Congratulations, GPA works. Please send us an inbox with your name, contact number, and address on YouTube or Facebook. Uh, I suggest you do it on Facebook, not on, not on YouTube. <laughs> if you send it here, everyone will know and start to send you, you know, hate letters because you won and they lost. So yeah, <laughs> we will be inviting more modders to the streams, and Jesse will be back too. Yeah, I will be back. I'm always around. I'm always around. Um, anything, any a company that will ask me to. Uh, to help the modding industry or anything in, in industry, I'm all up for. So again, congratulations to uh, GPA Works for following. Yeah, and um, if you guys have any other topics that you wanna uh, put up, um, uh, please uh, put it on the comment section uh, on here or on Facebook or whatever. Uh, let the uh, re let them. <coughs> I'll let them know, um, and then they will have um, a lot more other modders. Uh, you know, uh, bring up or talk to you guys about uh, other stuff. So, so yeah. If you guys got a topic, let let Thermal Take know. Um, you can let me know so we can I can relay it over to Thermal Take or whichever. Just you know, a any way we can. Uh, we can figure out what to do. Hey, sir, not cool. All right, so archaeologist is here. Uh, he's a client that we uh, uh, that uh, that a PC we've been working on for the past uh, couple of days is already here. So I'm going to be ending this live stream again, 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 again. Thank you very much uh, for everyone who joined this stream. Uh, everyone who put in uh, gave me, you know. Uh, 96 minutes of their time uh, to 96 minutes of the time in their lives to you know it's uh, totally appreciated um, it's you know that uh, I like to do what I do and I only do it for the people who like what I do I don't know if that makes any sense but yeah um, thank you thank you very much thank you thermal take thank you everyone thank you Corey thank you Darth thank you mad mods thank you tantric thank you GPA, thank you, Paul, thank you, Rich, thank you, everyone, 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 Nedim, and all the other people. Thank you guys for joining. We will be cutting off in uh, three, two, one. Bye bye. Mod on, guys. <laughs>